And if you look at my C6, you'll see it's ducking every time it sees that kick. Just kind of a good little trick to get the bass out of the way when the kick hits. Nice little trick that uh, David Guetta uses a lot. If you actually listen, check out anything he's talked about online, he's, he's one of those guys that likes to make sure his kick and his bass are always not together. So it makes, helps make room for the kick drum, which is the most important thing when you're making dance music. I'm actually kind of using it as a side chain, and I'm triggering the C6 with my drum loop that I just played you. So you see the input here is bus 31, and that's my usual same bus I use on every song, and I'm bussing my kick snare that you just heard, bus 31, it's being triggering my compressor on the bass. This is actually a crazy plugin that you need to check out yourself.